Hi and welcome to this video tutorial by myself, Antichristos XIX by I on IMView.com and uh, today we are going to be doing the very long awaited um, video tutorial on how to actually export a mesh from uh, SketchUp into IMView and uh, at this point if you've been following my video tutorials you should already have your uh, plugins installed you should have the mesh out plugin installed and you should have the Merlin tools plugin installed and um, I'm just going to start using them now um, first of all what we're going to do is we need sa a mesh that we want to export so uh, we're going to just quickly make a basic mesh so I'm using the rectangle tool here on the orange one, and I'm just going to pull out and I'm going to use the push tool tool just to make it into a box okay so I've got this just a basic shape I'm going to switch over to the top view. I'm going to use the line tool here on the edge and directly across over here. I'm just going to make a basic shape over here. Um, what I'm doing is I'm going to make a chair. It's just a very basic chair. So pull that down. Go back up to the top here. The line tool again. One on the other side doesn't need to be symmetrical. This is just for uh, for demonstration purposes. I'm just going to use the push tool again. Once again, okay, just a basic chair. And now what I'm going to do is just going to select the mesh. I'm just going to select it all here, and I'm going to export it now. I've got the mesh built, and now we're going to export it. So just go into plugins, go into the mesh out, and we haven't we haven't textured it, so I'm just going to include untextured faces. If you've got a textured version and everything's textured, um, you can just and you know everything is textured, then you just use the export IMView file set. If not, if you don't have anything textured or you've got missing textures, just use include untextured faces. Okay, it's going to tell us we need to save it. Save as. actually save in there. I'm just going to make a new folder here. Okay, it does save it. And it saves it as a S dot SKP, which is a SketchUp model file. Okay, so now it's saved. We're going to go back into Mesh House and we go into the plugins, Mesh House and Export Export IMView file set include ex untextured faces and we're just going to go and export it and now it's saved so now I've put that in my C drive so wherever you had saved that uh, SketchUp uh, model it will the, the exported file is going to be there so um, let me just go to that quickly It was in this test folder that I made, and here we go. We have the skeleton and the mesh file over here. So um, what we're going to do now is we want to put this into IM View. And this is obviously a furniture product, so we're just going to go to Derive New Rooms and Furnitures, just a regular furniture product. We're going to exp just going to go load this up now. Okay, so now you've got the IM view chair in, and you want to just put in your own chair mesh in now. Um, to do that, we need to be on the meshes tab. We go into add dot xmf. Sorry, dot xmf. 
and then we just go into here to the, just browse to wherever the your XMF file is that that's in over in that's in the same file location that you saved the dot uh, skp file there just open that up and we're going to apply the changes and there it goes there's your mesh it's sitting in there it's a bit out of scale because we didn't just uh, we didn't uh, scale it properly at all but there's your mesh in IM view and it's because uh, it was all there was untextured faces it just assigned one texture by default um, and we will uh, put in I'll do another video tutorial uh, about how to actually texture your meshes um, unfortunately SketchUp leaves a lot to be desired when it comes to uh, mapping your textures on meshes but we will assign some textures to your meshes in the next video tutorial Thanks for watching this one and please keep subscribed.